Hey kids, David here with just a very quick message. I've had a couple of folks saying that they've had a non-numeric variable thing appearing when they add something to the cart, you know. Uh, this is with this online shop tutorial, of course. Uh, on my one, it's all cool. Look, I can add to basket and everything is fine. But uh, another one, this is my uh, good buddy Carlos, when you do add to basket, you get this non-numeric variable thing. And there's a few of you folks who have that, okay? Don't worry, you have not done anything wrong. I'll show you what the thing is. Uh, on my thing, if I do get where like this, this is on store item sizes, by the way. Uh, everything is cool. Get where ID. If the ID is non-numeric or anything, it's going to fire and everything is fine. But the one that I think you folks have, the version that you've got, you'll probably find you've got a little if statement in here. If not is numeric, then die non-numeric variable. That's what's giving you the error. So it's just that your store item sizes has a bit more, let's, let's be graceful and call it security. You have a little bit more security than me and that's all cool. There's nothing wrong with that. In fact, I think that's actually a better way to go. So the way to fix that, folks, is see on this thing that says get value here on store basket. If I was you, I would keep this thing. Keep that in. That's a nice little if statement. I think it's cool, right? But here's your solution. Jump into the store basket get value and say if not is numeric update ID, then update ID equals zero. That's your solution. Thank you very much indeed. And uh, sorry about that one. <laughs> okay, you haven't done anything wrong. It's all cool. I'll see you in the next video.